MPLAB Express has been designed to work primarily with Git. A temporary sandbox is provided which will store your project for up to a week, but getting familiar with the Git or GitHub workflows is an important part of using Express. So let's start by creating a new project. If we have an existing project open, you'll see that we already have a project in the sandbox and that this will be deleted if we continue. Let's choose a Q43, one of the new picks with DMA, configurable logic, and a 12-bit ADC with computation. Selecting the variant from the Curiosity Nano Evaluation Kit. Note that this project will exist in the cloud sandbox until either the session times out or you log out. So to save the work, we either file export to download to use with MPLABX, or as we'll do in this video, go view Git controls to commit to a Git repository. So our project is created. Just as with MPLABX IDE, we need to add a new file to at least add a main.c to our project. So we select C main file and give it the name main. Then click finish. So here's that file we added. And now we can go view Git controls. And you can see all the different files here and the changes. And at the top here, you can see add remote. So if we go and create a repository, Q43 hello. And let's say this is our first Express project and create the repository. The bottom here it says use the URL for this page when adding a GitHub as a remote. So we can copy here and use this as our remote URL. Next we can stage all changes and first commit and commit and push. So here we just enter our credentials. So going back to our repository and refreshing, we can now see our project files, including main.c. Now let's go and make some changes. We'll just add a comment to show the workflow. We stage just the changes of that file and then add a commit comment. Commit push and refreshing, we can see that our comment is added. Going back to Express under view Git history, we can also see a lot more information of each of the commits, the commit message and files changed, etc. In the next video, we'll show you simulated debugging and the project dashboard in MPLAB Express.